the direct path of the rogue planet's rings. Everything from London off to Tokyo, this ring system can have some things the size of school buses. We've got ring particles showering down over the side of the planet facing the incoming rogue world. That's a disaster in and of itself. That's going to make the mother of all meteor showers. It would be like a literal rainstorm. You would have that many things coming in. But now imagine that each raindrop is a meteor. As the larger particles hit the atmosphere, they too burn and explode. It would be like thousands of times the Russian meteor, the Chelyabinsk episode that we all saw on our TVs. Chelyabinsk was a asteroid impact, very simply. Something entered the atmosphere at a very high rate of speed and blew up over Chelyabinsk, Russia. This beautiful fireball in the sky had a shockwave. The shockwave exploded out glass windows, hurting 1,500 people. Think of that times a million. Shanghai's population of over 14 million is under siege. Any sort of rescue operation in a flooding city turns into a catastrophe. This is not, hey, let's get some people to safety, because suddenly fireballs are raining down on humanity. A huge fireball coming into a city effectively explodes. In Western Europe, cities are hit just as hard as Shanghai. You would get the firestorm, you would get the hurricane force winds. Buildings don't survive. Big Bang and the parliament, everything disappeared. It's level instantly. Let's say you're in Rome watching all of this stuff coming on in. You're going to feel the heat from this event on your skin. If you're within even 100 miles, you'll get burns. Then the shock wave hits, a pressure wave that would shatter windows and knock over cars. And that's only one fragment. The results would be absolutely catastrophic. And all the while, as the rogue planet gets closer, the winds get stronger and the Earth keeps shaking. So as we're going through the ring plane, all of this is taking place in the background of a steadily mounting earthquake. So it's not the same as what you see in Hollywood. It's actually much more devastating. The horror seems endless, and millions of people are dead. But it takes just five minutes for Europe and Asia to pass through the deadly rings of the rogue planet. Oceans away, in cities like Boston, Los Angeles, and Denver. The trembling earth, high winds, and rising waters are only the first